there's one less cop on the streets of Liberty City. What do you mean, Packy? I mean that my cop brother Francis McCreary is no longer with us. You and Jerry must be very upset. Hardly. Couldn't stand the bastard myself. That said, the only celebrating Jerry's gonna be able to do will be in prison. He got hauled in last night. Shit, is it serious? Charges ain't gonna stick, don't worry. Anyway, it means a lot to the family if you come to Francis' funeral. It's at the church in Suffolk today. I'll stop by, man. I'll see you there. Remember to wear a suit, Nico. Can't have you dressed like a bum in the church. Hey, be cool, all right? Hi, Nico. Hey, Kate. I am sorry to hear about your brother. You're probably the only one. He was too much of a cop for my family to accept him and too much of a gangster to be accepted by the cops. What did you think about him? To be honest, I thought this would have happened earlier. Then again, I expect to get a call from the coroner about any one of my brothers every day. You going to be at the funeral? Sure. I'll see you there, Kate. Goodbye. And while no one is suggesting he was an angel, none of us are. <laughs> that is why God put us on earth and not in heaven. The trials of humanity were sometimes too much for him to bear. But he was a committed family man and a man of beliefs. God asks us to show faith, and that is what he did in his way. Francis gave so much of himself and will be sorely missed by us all. Amen. 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 Now, if you will all please join me in the procession to the cemetery. Francis, I'm uh, sorry for your loss. I'm not. I'm sorry for Ma. I gave up on my brothers a long time ago. Most I ever expected from them was to put flowers on their coffins. Hmm. You have a strange family. Who doesn't? I don't know.
from, right? Get out of the church! Come on! Okay, Nico. Time to get out of here. But I ain't leaving my poor dead brother to the mercy of them animals. Frankie's plot is in the graveyard on Colony Island, Nico. Can we put him in the ground? with a cop in the car. Can we call for backup or something? Are you suggesting that I'm a fucking cop? I thought that you would know better than that. No, you dumb European fuck. I met my brother, Francis. It was a joke. Hell of a fucking time to be making jokes about your dead brother. You know, I'm still not that fond of the guy, even in his death. I guess that's what turning cop will do to a fraternal relationship. I guess you've got enough brothers to hate one of them. Swiftly running out, Nico. Ain't got that many left. Now that Francis is on his way to the graveyard and Gerald is behind bars, all I got left is that smackhead Derek. You've got Katie. I could have fucking guessed you'd bring her up. I was thinking you only kept those hitmen away from the church to protect my sister. I did it all for you. Sure you did, Nico. Tell yourself you did it. Out of the grace of your own heart, rather than for another piece of your anatomy. Which ain't gonna get used, I might add. This is it. We can put him in the ground now. Thanks, Nico. What for? Guys like you don't like cops. Being here, helping us out, I appreciate it. It's not that I don't like cops. You do what you do to get by. Cops are just regular guys trying to survive. Anyway, I'm not here for Francis. I'm here for you and Packy. Like I said, thanks. Give me a call sometime, Nico. Go. Gerald McCreary here. 
calling from the Alderney State Correctional Facility. Hey, Jerry. I heard you've been locked up. I'm sorry to hear that. We gotta discuss something. I put you on the visitors list here. You come down. <laughs>